<laughs> he was so uh, kind to the kids, and he was always, you know, like telling them good stories, and it was really funny. Monsignor Kevin Wallen, seen here on the left next to former Bridgeport Bishop William Laurie, was arrested by federal agents at his Waterbury home earlier this month. The whole street was filled with cops, and they took some guy out in handcuffs. The U.S. Attorney's Office says Wallen and several others were running a drug operation where crystal meth was bought from California and shipped into Connecticut so it could be sold. Wallen served at St. Augustine's in Bridgeport for nearly a decade. Back in 2011, he took a leave of absence, citing health issues. The charges involve six drug transactions between September of 2012 and this month. They were taking bags of stuff from the house. The Bridgeport Diocese tells us Monsignor Kevin Wallen's arrest comes with a sense of shock and concern. It goes on to say, the diocese stands ready to help as it has throughout the past two years. We ask for prayers for Monsignor Wallen during the difficult days ahead of him. I don't want to judge anybody, but it's, it's, it's tough.